friends i am shailendra singh and today i am going to tell you how you can restore your oracle database having container database and pluggable database in 19c so let's first we must have to perform the rmn backup in order to show you now i am performing the backup backup database backup archive log all you can see backup has been performed successfully and now i'm co just copying the backup piece name of auto backup having control file and sp file in order to restore it later so guys uh, you must have oracle armen backup in scheduled with archive logs and in case of any event if you required to restore it that's i'm demonstrating how you can restore it i have copied the like a piece name in restore command let's first shut down the instance instance has been shut down and now i i will delete the sp file the data files of the container database and data files of the pluggable database and the control file another control file which resides in the recovery area so let's delete the sp file first after that i will delete the data files of the container database or shell and the pluggable database or shell pd and after that i will remove the second control file from the recovery area and in order to restore the oracle database from armen backup first we have to restore the server parameter file to in order to restore the server parameter file we have to start the instance in host no mount mode for that we require a init file with some basic parameters having database name memory size few only few parameters are required there so i am restarting the instance mostly in no mode mode in order to restore the sp file from the auto backup So instance has been restarted in no more mode firstly with the parameter file which i shown to you now i am going to restore the sp file from the backup piece you can see backup 
from the backup is sp file has been restored successfully so now i will start the instance in no mode mode with the server parameter file you can see here sp file ora dot orcl dot ora has been restored in the desired location and uh, i will show you in the ora data there is nothing so let's first start the instance in no mount mode in order to restore the control files so i'm starting the instance and i will restore the control file restore control file from the path of the auto backup file instance has been started in no mount mode using server parameter file which was restored earlier and now i am restoring the control file you can see both the control files have been restored successfully and now i am going to start the instance in mount mode using the server parameter file and control file which has been restored successfully from the oracle backup is instance has been started in mount mode you can see here now i am going to restore the database from the armen now you can see database is being restored now will database container database all the data files have been restored successfully and uh, now i will require the database in order to open it first now i am giving the command alter database open reset logs it will open the database after resetting the logs and i will show you now the open mode the database name from the v dollar database view it has been opened in the read mode you can see now from v dollar database view and i will show you that reset logs have been performed successfully from the view again let's copy the fields from the as you can see open reset log i will show you again from the dollar database view you can see here uh, open reset logs not allowed because it has been reset and i will now uh, shut down the da database instance and start it in normal mode and show you the reset time reset logs time from the same view so let's copy the field 
another column Insert logs time. It is shutting down the instance. You can see database has been closed, dismounted, and instance set down has been completed now. I am going to start in normal mode startup. So I will show you this at time. You can see here uh, today's time when reset logs has been performed. So by this you can restore your Oracle database. 